Modern Realm back again uh, to review the Bob All Terrain Pro Stroller. Before I start, I just want to say thank you for watching this video. Hit like and subscribe. It definitely helps the YouTube channel. So I just did a, a side by side of the Bob All Terrain Pro and the Rambler, but I wanted to do a separate video just of the, the review of the All Terrain Pro. I have to say, hands down, I love this stroller. I've gone through about five strollers so far um, to the Chico Bravo, um, the, the Bumble Ride, the Bob Rambler, uh, the Bob All, All Terrain Pro, and um, my sister had a Greco, a Greco drive, a Greco running stroller as well. Um, I love this Bob All Terrain Pro. One thing I do have to say about the All Terrain Pro though, I couldn't start using it until about now. I'm, I'm seven months postpartum. I, I really started using it around six or seven months. It is a heavy stroller. It's heavy to push. It's a lot to push. I had a, t a bit of a tough recovery. So, um, so I wasn't able to use this stroller as soon as the baby was born. I really had to wait. And at first when I had to wait, I thought, oh my God, I don't like this stroller. It's like way too heavy. But after, um, ap after waiting it about out about six months and, and really getting stronger after that postpartum recovery, I do, I changed my mind. I love this stroller. Okay. So first we'll go things that I love about the stroller and then, um, and then cons. And hopefully this will help you make a decision about what type of stroller you want in your, in your toolkit. Now, I, I bought this stroller at Kohl's. Um, I used some gift cards, and then I also bought it when Kohl's was giving back that cash back. So I think this stroller retails for $679. So I used some of the gift cards, and then Kohl's gave me, um, I wanna say like $150 back in rewards because I bought it during that time. I did have to buy it online. Of course, does not stock these in the store, but just a little tip on, on how I bought that. I know strollers are expensive and um, you know, it's, it's nice to save money wherever we can. So a couple of things that I love about this Bob, this canopy, it is full covering. I love that. And then it's got a peekaboo window here. Uh, this peekaboo window, it's got a netting and it's got the plastic and it's magnet. Um, the other thing about the All Terrain Pro is it's got this extra zipper pocket here for storage. Now I did have to buy the, the cup holder, um, but the nice thing is, is you don't necessarily have to buy one because the All Terrain Pro has pockets underneath here that you could, that fits water bottles and all different kinds of stuff down here. Um, so that's, and if you're using this strictly for jogging, it depends, definitely you're going to want to bring water, but you know, how much, uh, like how much are you going to be carrying just because the more you carry, the more you got to push, right? <laughs> um, this, so the nice thing about this canopy is it doesn't roll up. It rolls right into this little flap here. So if you don't want the canopy, if you want to see your baby, you want the canopy up, I hope I can tilt this a little bit. Um, you can see that canopy, it just rolls right up. Or you can roll it down. So, that's one thing I love about the Bob. Another thing I love about the Bob, which I feel like is standard in a lot of strollers, um, but surprisingly it doesn't have it on the offering, uh, on the Rambler, I should say, is it does have the adjustable handlebars. So however you're feeling that day, if you want a low handlebar or a higher one, Usually I stay about the middle, but sometimes I usually, I do use the higher one. I just like it, personal preference. Um, the other great thing I love about the Pro is this seat. Your baby is sitting in luxury in this seat. It is waterproof. This whole seat is waterproof. It is very sturdy. The, I love how, because this is a jogging stroller and meant for jogging, and it is truly a good jogging stroller. I jog um, a few times with this stroller and it, it wheels great. Um, it's got nice back support. It's also got, uh, it 
It's also got compartments in here for your baby as well, which is great. Sometimes what I'll do is I'll give my baby a toy and, and she's seven months, so she can't really get anything on her own just yet, but I'll put the toy in, in these pockets so we don't lose it. Um, I do also like this deep, um, this deep foot bed. That's really nice as well. And then the tires are great. Um, so we have a 12 inch tire in the front and then 16 inch tires in the back, which I love. Uh, so this definitely wheels really well. I did not take this to the beach yet. This will be my next beach stroller to try out. I took the Bumble Ride to the beach. The Bumble Ride wheels good, wheels good on the beach, um, on the soft sand. And then we took the Bob Rambler uh, to the beach. And that was a bit harder for me on the soft sand. So I have not taken this All Terrain Pro. Again, this is a video for the All Terrain Pro to the beach, um, but uh, that is gonna be our next trip. The other thing I love about this one is the way it folds. And originally I did not like the way it folds, but now I have really grown to love it. So underneath the seat here, there's a little knob, you turn it, and then it just folds down like this. Now it still is a very big stroller. So, um, so it's just big. And how do I get it to stand here? Oh, I just have to adjust the handlebars. There we go. And then it will just stand up like this. Um, I also like how you can just <laughs> wheel it around. <laughs> just wheel it like this. I did have a Nissan Juke, um, that small little hatchback car. If I flip the seat down, I can lift this up and it will fit right in the Nissan Juke. Now, again, that I did lose seating space, but, but that did work. Uh, so it does fit in the back. It can fit in the back of smaller cars as long as you flip that, that back seat down. Um, so cons about the all-terrain pro. I guess one con would be the weight. It is quite heavy, um, but it is sturdy. My dad calls it, he's like, he's like, it's like riding in a Cadillac. It's just like, it's just a tank. Like this stroller is just, you could just feel the weight on it, um, which is good. So it makes, makes me feel comfortable that my baby is safe. Um, I have to say the only con that about this stroller that I found or that was for me is the basket underneath. Um, I find it really difficult to, if I have a full diaper bag, I find it difficult to put the diaper bag in the, in the basket. Um, either I have to put the diaper bag in the basket, uh, either I have to put the diaper bag in the basket uh, before I put baby in the basket or even when baby's in the basket, I can't get the diaper bag out without lifting up this seat and adjusting. So that would be the only downfall of it. I, I am looking into getting maybe a smaller diaper bag just for that reason. Um, but to me, that, that, that would be the only con that I have about this all-terrain stroller. This is meant for jogging. So when I'm doing this review, I'm thinking of it in a jogging mindset. If you were thinking, if you're thinking about using this as your everyday stroller, um, you can definitely do that, but it is big. It's, it's a big everyday stroller. And I guess if you are using it as your everyday stroller, I would just say the con would be how big it is and the weight. I mean, you can even see like I'm five foot two and I'm standing here and you'd see how, how big this stroller is. So, um, so I hope this helped in your review of the All Terrain Pro. I do love this stroller. I love it. I mean, this is like one of my favorite strollers. We go for, for what we're out in the stroller every day. We go for walks around the neighborhood. We go for little jogs. I mean, it just, so far it wheels over everything. I, there's just, you know, so much I can say about this. So many good things I can say about the stroller that outweigh the, the basket issue that I have. So thank you all for watching this video and sticking with me um, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.